All right, let's see. I'm going to name this keyboard for Procreate. Now let's see if these update. Hopefully it updated. I don't even know if I'm streaming yet. Let me see, doc. Restream channels. Looks like I'm online. Looks like I'm online in YouTube and Twitch. Hope you all had a very Merry Christmas, if you celebrate Christmas. Oh, I was wondering where this, wondering where that went. And, okay, I can close this. I see the chats here, so. I was sent this. I'm trying to clean this so I can get a nicer, a nicer thumbnail. But I don't think it's gonna clean. So anyway, someone wanted to um, add a post to my Procreate group on Facebook. And, you know, I don't really, you know, I don't, I don't really post things to my Facebook group unless I know what they are. I'm, I'm used to it. I, you know, I, I have experience with it. And I don't know what this is. I know there, I know there was a, there were some issues with, I don't know if, I don't think it was this brand, but something like this, but I've never used it. I never knew um, if it was useful for me or not. So I figured I would do a live and we will see what I think. Maybe I should record this also. I probably should have recorded. Well, I guess I can always download the video. Um, yeah, I can always download the video. It's probably better. So this is from China, and I believe it's called Aoiktai, 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 something like that. I'm not good with getting these things open. Normally I would just edit around this, but since I'm live, I can't edit around it. But if I do wind up liking it, then I'll, I'll make a thorough review. Um, maybe I'll do a Facebook Live in the group. That might be cool too. I'll just reopen it. Okay, so. So that's that. Also, let me know if I'm too loud. Hopefully I'm not too loud. This I have a little USB. And then we have our little cute little Procreate keyboard. It's very nice looking. Feels very nice. I like it. It's light. Okay, so let's see how I'm supposed to, how this is supposed to work. Aoiktai, procreate, and the rest of the words are in Chinese, so I can't read them. Let's see. Wireless shortcut keyboard for procreate user manual. Bluetooth, lithium ba lithium battery, hibernation time 15 minutes, raking temperature, low battery indicator, okay, okay. This Bluetooth keyboard builds with a 250 ma rechargeable lithium battery. Please get it charged before first use. Okay, so it looks like I have to charge it up. So let me start that while I keep continue to look at the... Uh, while I continue to look at the keyboard. Actually, I can just use, use my plug here. 
that I always have plugged in. Oh, there we go. It looks like it's uh, USB or macro, I think it is. So it's not USB-C, it's USB macro. And then we have our little charging light. Okay, product specifications, keyboard power switch. Okay, so this is the power switch right here. So you turn it on and then you long press the wrench until LED light indicator flashes into blue color, which means the keyboard has entered into pairing mode. Run the Bluetooth setup assistant on your pad and select Ioiktai from the list pairing connection. Okay, so I will do that. Function of each button. This is very tiny. So let's see. All right, actions popfer. I don't know what popfer means. Actions popfer, but maybe it's just the, the performs actions. Full screen. So I'm assuming this is like the four finger type. Popfer. Maybe popfer is popover. Layer popover. So I'm curious to see what that actually is. Remove from the layer. So maybe this is just deletes the whole clear layer. Increase brush size. Quick menu, paint tool, erase tool. Decrease brush size. Layer popover. <laughs> popover is really killing me. Undo, redo, switch colors. So I, I think that's switch colors. So maybe it goes back to the previous color. Selection tool, transform tool, HSB. What is HSB? I'm not sure what HSB is. Color balance, eyedropper, command. So pretty useful. I mean, I would say that it seems pretty useful. Um, and then we have some other ones. So it's if you press this together with... So this and this deletes the whole layer. Increase brush size by one. So I hold down the command, increase brush size by one, decrease brush size by one. Command, what is that? Copy, so command this is copy. Command, copy. Cut. So this is cut. And paste is this, okay, so that's kind of cool. Copy, cut, paste. That's great. They have the little CXV like on a, a regular keyboard shortcut. I like it so far. Common problem solutions. <laughs> What's up, Jen? What's up, Linda? Good to see you guys. Hope you guys had a nice holiday if you celebrate it or just a nice uh, weekend even. Um, so this is the Ioktai Procreate keyboard. Um, I didn't pay for it, so they sent me this to kind of check it out. And um, because they wanted me to, to um, post some things about it in my group but i just i said that i you know I, I don't know the product i've never used it so i just like you know I'm, I'm happy to if you send me the product i'll do a live video i'll make a video for it if i find it useful if i think it's cool and uh yeah it's for the ipad and i just figured i will uh i will give it a try so i figured i would unbox it on live because i mean i, I just figured i would just keep it completely honest as honest as i can 
Um, but yeah, so far so good. I mean, it seems pretty interesting. I'm supposed to charge it up for uh, before first use. So I have it charged here and I just went over all the basic fun functions. Um, so it pairs via Bluetooth. So it'll, it'll pair via Bluetooth and it just basically is a lot of these shortcuts. So it seems like the type of thing where if you get really used to the shortcuts, it can be very helpful. And I've never really looked into it, so I'm kind of, it's kind of cool. I'm kind of glad that I have one to experiment with. And maybe it's something that'll be, you know, pretty handy. So, and anything that's handy, if I like it, I'm happy to post it to the group, tell people about it. You know, obviously, I mean, I, I have this now. I'm not trying to make any money off of it, but um, if it's useful, if it's cool, if it works, hey, that's great. Common problem solutions. Some keys cannot be used. The iPad input method can be used by changing to American English input. The iPad input method can be used by changing it to American English input method. Some keys cannot be used. Okay. The color sucking key in Procreate software cannot be used. Just to control straw, Apple Pencil. How to activate your on-screen keyboard, please do the following in iPad settings, accessibility, touch, assistive, show on-screen keyboard, mouse. Okay, so hopefully I don't have, so there's, these are common problems. I might have to go back to this and sort of work through that and figure it out, but, um, but yeah, we'll see. But anyway, what are you guys up to? How are you guys doing? Now what's HM? Did you see? I, th I thought at first you were referring to uh, HSB, which I don't know. I don't know what that is. Hue, hue saturation, maybe? Maybe it's hue saturation something. I'm not sure. Drawing. Linda It's always drawing. She's always doing something. Well, actually, no. Grading or drawing. Grading or drawing. I just want to start. Let me see if I can raise this. Oh, also, um, this is. Wait, I gotta figure out a way that I can just like put up an image. Why <laughs> should be sleeping? Hue saturation and brightfish. Charmaine coming through, coming through for the buzzer beater. <laughs> Hue saturation and brightness. Copy, copy that. Um, see, that's why I need to do things on live so I can just get, just get help right off the bat because, you know, I can sound like I know what I'm talking about, but not, not always, not always. <clears throat> All right. So I wonder how, how I know when it's fully charged. Maybe this will turn green or something like that. But, uh, so let me see if I can figure out how to show a screen. I think this I think this shows this is gonna be this is gonna be freaky for a second. Okay, so that shows the MacBook screen. So let me go back here. So maybe that's what I want. So let me see if I can add this to this source. So I'll add display capture I think or is it window capture maybe it's window capture no I don't have any so let me add a display capture display capture so I might have to make this really small figure out how to do this oh I don't know which one I'm supposed to press maybe it's this one god this is so freaky Hello, 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 hello. <laughs> I apologize. I really do. I sincerely do. Okay, so. But how do I make it so? I guess I, I guess I have to get out of this. But you know what? I'll make this small. I'll do this because I don't. I know you guys don't care about all of my stupid computer stuff that's here. 
Although maybe it might be interesting, I don't know. So, I'll do that. I'll do that. Well, I guess I can... I guess I'll leave it, that's fine. And I'll make this smaller. So if I put this here, then I should be able to like show you guys stuff easily. Although I won't be able to see it. But what did I, what did I want to show you in the first place? Oh, I wanted to show you my sign. I wanted to show you my my sign. So this is my sign, my cool on air sign that I have that my fiance got for me. So it's really cool. Don't mind the paper behind it. I just have a couple holes in the wall because I tried to drill something in and it didn't work. Um, but I think I might be able to fold the paper so it just covers the air on air sign and I might be able to cover up those blemishes in the wall, unfortunately. I'm not a do-it-yourself person, so I have issues with that sometimes. Okay, so display capture, I'll bring to the... I'll just ixnay it. <laughs> to infinity and beyond. Speaking of in, uh, to infinity and beyond, did you see my... Did you see the video that I did? for the um the little preview of the robot guy like i had so much fun making that video and like trying to make it so like he seems like a buzz lightyear type robo mech character i mean obviously it was fun making the character but like it was also fun making the video i feel like i can i feel like i can play it now that i've sort of figured out how to so i have to undo that but it's probably very small I had so much fun making that video. Um, but yeah, this is how my like, my Google, all the stuff that I download, like all my Google stuff. It's all my Christmas stuff. This shirt I think I got in like 1996, 1994, 95 maybe. Actually, I don't remember. But when I go home, I wear all of my, like, vintage sweatshirts. Like this old Abercrombie sweatshirt. I like to wear all my old stuff. There it is. Oh, but it's not, it's probably definitely not clear there, so. And this is my little radish that I made. And I put yellow behind it because I feel like that's much cuter. Anyway. Let me meet, let me get rid of this display capture. Thank you, Linda. I appreciate that. Well, so what time is it? So you should be sleeping. So what time is it? And please try it out. I definitely, I definitely am going to try it out. Um, I guess, what do you guys think? You think it's fine? I don't want to... Eat. Little things like that make me nervous. Actually, can you... No, I guess you probably can't see that green thing. Let me just click on this so it goes away, because it's annoying for me. Midnight. Ooh, I go out walking after midnight in the starlight. Dun, 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 dun. I go out walking... That's actually my real life. Any, anything that reminds me of a song, I sing out loud. I, I can't help it. And also another piece of tech that I used when I took a photo of it, of the box. Oh, actually, I, I couldn't, I, I wasn't able to show you because when I do Twitch and, when I do Twitch and YouTube, it doesn't allow me to, um, it doesn't allow me to uh, put the thumbnail up. Although maybe I can do it. Let's see if I can do it now. Um, channel content. Okay. I wonder if I can turn this on yet. So it says live art sketches. Oh, so I can turn the monetization on. 
And I think I might be able to edit this video. Or edit the stream. Let's see. Let's see if it edits. Oh, let me turn on the window so you guys can see too. Sorry. I have to, I, like, this is like a new thing now that I can do the window, so. Oop, not this. But that's the, but that's the thumbnail. Okay. Um, trying out. Okay. So now I just trying out the Aoktai Procreate Keyboard. And I'll put my I have to change my settings in Restream to put like my actual website and stuff there. Okay, so let me see if I can update this with the live stream drawing. So that's good. Upload thumbnail. Let's see if this works. Okay. Oh, so it looks like it's still live. Hopefully you guys are still there. Let me check. Let me go back to my OBS screen. Okay. Phone can was only full face. Full face. I did not work for. I like seeing my face so big. Um, I did not. I've never worked for Disney. I've never worked for Disney or anything close to it. Um. But I do draw a lot from that style. I do draw a lot from, uh, <clears throat> and what I mean by draw a lot is I do use that as my inspiration, um, studying their characters, studying um, just how they, how they problem solve and how they break down characters. So I do, uh, Um, so I do draw a lot of my inspiration from Disney. I think they're great. And I think what's really, really funny is, you know, Disney, Disney encompasses like a wide range of different types of artwork, different types of styles. Um, so it's always funny to me when I get the compliment that, you know, my stuff looks like Disney, which I love because I, I really feel like Disney... The thing that Disney does best is uh, they're just best at, with all of their work and all of their art, they're really good at condensing real things, people, animals, to very appealing, simple characters. Stream changed. The title of stream matures with the thumbnail is your angry stream. The title of the stream changed, okay, but the thumbnail is your, okay, interesting. Interesting. Good to know. Um, the monet monetization on YouTube. Monetization on YouTube is... Uh, I mean, it's not bad. It's not bad. I mean, it's... I had a good month. I just, I had, Some of my videos did really well last month. So last month was pretty good. Um, but let's see. Let me go to... Okay, so this is saved. So 
So, yes, yeah, subscribers are doing well. Watch time is doing well. Everything's been doing well. I think what really helps is doing a lot of live videos. I'm just able to do more content. More than usual. So this has been my top video. This little, quick, little 42 second how to download 3D model samples and procreate. It's funny, you just never know what people are gonna, like people, I feel like people really use, I mean, they use it as a, as entertainment obviously, but also just like as, as a utility. Like this is a utility video. You know how to do something. What are the best brushes? Cut an image in any shape. So like they really like utility videos. What are the best brushes for line work? I need to do some more like this. What are the best? Because people post that a lot. And they're easy for me. Like this, I can just do things that I use that I think are the best at f doing certain things. Well, you know, the brush that I think is best for sketching, the brush that I think is best for line work. You know, I really need to do some more of those. But these, yeah, these, these videos are the ones that um, have done the best. I think... Uh, So the last 28 days, 153. November was good month. So. And these, like, these posted videos, they do okay, but it's also, like, Christmas and stuff, so there might not have been that many people that are really on it. Um, so the views are a bit low here. Not bad. I'm actually really glad that the Christmas one is doing well, which means that people are buying the brush. I mean, I, I would assume that they're buying the brush, that more people are buying the brush. The live videos seem to be, they do well, though. They get like a decent amount of hits. Not really great. I mean, people get like, I mean, this is like peanuts. My my channel is peanuts compared to like some people that just post and they have three, four thousand views on every video. Um, that's where I want to be eventually, but definitely not there yet. I wonder what else I can do on. Um, I wanted to show my video. I wonder what else I can do to my own video if I'm looking at it. Oh God, I have to mute this. I can do here eight watching yeah you know um, it's funny I can I can see the the comments here oh god but now it's creepy because it's oh wait, what is that is that the actual video oh yeah it is let me get out of here because now it's just showing a video of a video of a video of a video it's getting ridiculous uh, this is even like weird for me to look at um but yeah, it's, you know, I don't, I don't, I don't like, uh, I don't like, there's just, there's a, I'm, I don't know, but you're right. People don't really show like that kind of stuff, like the kind of stuff that you want to know. Like when I was like researching the YouTube thing and doing all this stuff, you know, there's some people that do, but a lot, yes, definitely with the matrix, a lot of people don't share this kind of thing and like I don't know I just like to help people like I still feel like I'm a beginner in a lot of this stuff and I know there's a lot of people that like want to do even what I'm doing and want to go further than what I'm doing because I want to go further than what I'm doing so I just try to help and like I try to be transparent when it makes sense you know what I mean because like why not I mean it's not like 
you know, I'm making thousands of dollars or hundreds of thousands of dollars. And even if I was, you know, I, I would want people to sort of figure out what I'm doing so that they can do it too. Because, hey, the more the merrier. You know, it's not like there's so many YouTubers, it's not like I'm taking money away from people. So, you know, it, it's it's all about, you know, it's 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 just so easy. Like, it's so easy to just be open about things. Like, I, I, don't, I don't understand. Like, there's no, like, I feel like with YouTube, like, there's no competition really because I'm, like, my channel is Peanuts. You know, there's, like, main channels where if you notice, like, if you play videos and stuff, you you... You watch videos and then it ends and then it automatically plays like, for me, it's always like the same type of videos. Like it's always the videos that have or already have millions of views, millions of hits. Um, I've watched a lot of tech stuff on YouTube. Um, I mostly watch tech things and any sort of little documentary things. I love documentaries. So, um, you know, but it's like, you know, I like, I like to just, I don't know. Like, I mean, I don't even mind, like, showing people my computer. Like, I don't really have, I don't have anything that I'm, like, hiding on my computer. So it never really, like, bothers me. It's like, okay, so you get to see my numbers and see what I do. It's like, I want these numbers to grow, you know. And I know, and I was, I just started this, like, last year. Um, like, I really started getting into it in, like, 2020. I guess maybe, maybe it was, whenever the lockdown was, whenever, like, uh, COVID hit, that's when I was like, oh, you know what? I, I need to start going on my YouTube and like making something of it. So it's like, you know, I do have things that helped. Like one of my biggest um, boosts was Facebook groups, which is really, really weird. I never really used Facebook or went on Facebook or was active on Facebook. But um, then I started going on the groups and then I made my own group. But I made my own group with the intention of having a place that I can upload my videos to like my tutorials, like I just wanted to make tutorials and upload them. So they just had a, a place to live on the internet. And then I was like, well, why, like, why don't I just make a group and just have all the videos there so I can like easily scroll through them. And then people just started finding the group and following the group. So then I was like, all right, well, let me just turn it into the procreate group. And then it is what it is, you know, and now it's like a great group. And I don't know if you guys have ever seen it. I guess I can show you my group um so this is the group procreate tutorials and guidance uh it's a private group and it was there were certain things it was kind of weird when i was setting up the group like i just wanted to i wanted it to be like a public group but there's certain things that why well, I, I don't i can't remember why it became private I think it was a public group at first, but then like Facebook made some like changes and there were certain users and some certain things that there was some reason I had to, it automatically changed to a private group um, due to, uh, I don't even know what it was. It was like, I think it might've been the fact that some of the users like were like had private Facebook profiles and I don't remember what it was, but then it became private and I tried to make it public again, but uh, I don't know, Facebook, I don't really understand Facebook that much, so, but it's private, but if you, like, if you want to join it, all you have to do is say, like, oh, are you following Drug Free Dave on YouTube, are you following Drug Free Dave on Instagram, do you agree to follow the rules, if you answer those three questions, then you automatically get, um, <clears throat> accepted into the group, so it's not like, you know, no, nothing crazy but i figured the biggest use that it would be is like okay if i have this group and people are joining then i also want them to add me on instagram and add me on youtube so you know so that's like a nice like natural funnel you know and uh, you know I, I i i think it works do i have any member requests i don't think i have any oh yeah so there's some some people, for some reason, don't answer. Do you have? Do you agree to the group rules from the admin? And some people, for some reason, don't respond. I don't know why. Hasn't answered the membership questions. So I think some people just add it and they don't go through. But I always just like approve them anyway. I don't really. I'm not really. I don't really care about the, the questions. So I just approve them. Um. 
and also my brushes. This is my brush, my brushes on Gumroad. So I, I didn't even really plan. Like I've heard of Gumroad, but I hated the sound of the name. So I just never like really looked into it. I don't know. I don't know why Gumroad bothers me. But so I have, here's my products. So I have the Christmas gingerbread brushes, which I got to change this icon. I don't like this gingerbread anymore. The Epic Eyes Bundle, which is these eyes that I worked on on the live. And then I posted them here and they're $2. But you can use them like you can, you know, just use them for your characters. You just make an opening for the eyes and you can use them. I think it's cool. I actually want to make more eyes. Uh, the shapes, which um, are different shapes and stuff like that. I need to make some tutorials using these shapes. And then the Faves brushes were a mix of um, brushes that I've tweaked from stock brushes, changed them, uh, just pinpointed them so they're good for me. Um, also just some regular stock brushes and like that's why I'm not charging for it because you know it's not like I made all those brushes like myself so I'm like I'm not gonna it's dumb to charge for the stock brushes even though I feel like people would pay because like I feel like people just love buying brushes but with Gumroad it's great because they have the ability to if they want to donate if they want to buy it for two dollars they can if they want to buy it for a hundred dollars they can but if they want to get it for zero dollars that's how much it costs so yeah I mean they're pretty good 172 and the analytics lots from my my website which everything I changed all my YouTube stuff to point to my website which points back here um, cuz I had to get rid of Dropbox cuz that was not cool that whole Dropbox thing Oh, whoops. <laughs> that was so dumb. I thought I was on display capture. So dumb. Um, sorry about that. The, this is the Gumroad. So this is my analytics for Gumroad. And this is like for the month, basically. Yeah, and there's a, what I was just talking about. Let me go back to OBS and make sure that it's working. Okay, it looks like it's working now. I'm such a dum dum. You know what I really need? Uh, I really need a um, a way that you guys can actually like talk to me. Uh, what was I explaining before? Oh, I was explaining Facebook. That's right. I must have been. I was talking for so long. But here's the group. And 28.8, so it's it's pretty nice sized. And I I just post like prompts like this, like I posted this earlier today. You know, show off art, creative, related gifts, you know, why they come in handy, things like that. And lots of people lots of people post. Well, I guess my group is private, so technically maybe I maybe I shouldn't. I don't I don't know if I'm breaking any rules. <laughs> But, you know, I don't think anyone really cares. It's not really private. But, yeah, a lot of people, like, take part in the prompts, and it's really, really great. It's just, like, a place that people can, like... I have it so you don't... You can't post art to the group wall. You can only post tutorials because it's Procreate Tutorials. Or if you have, like, a question about Procreate, then you can post that to the group. Um, but I just... But I don't want people just posting their art to the group. So that's why I do these posts where it's, like, show off your art, you know, or, you know, something like that. And yeah, so that's my that's my Facebook group, Procreate Tutorials and Guidance. Uh, let me go back to OBS just to check in this time. Oh yeah, Discord. <laughs> um. Um, but hopefully you were able to see it just now. I think that should have worked. A Discord. Yeah, Discord is, Discord is a weird one. Let me, let me get my, let me open this up on my, um. You know what? I'm going to look at Discord, but I think right now, um, I'm going to try and stick to the thing. But I think in a live video, I'm going to try to set up a Discord. Because I'm hearing it a lot, 
and that usually means that I have to take advantage of it and get on, get with the program. But if you see, this is off, so we can get back to this. Oh, and before I was going to show you this. So when I take photos, when I, when I take the photo, I like put it over the camera like this, and I had to turn my turn my light on so I could like take the photo because I have no light going this way I just have light coming this way but this was cool I just got it off like Amazon I don't know for like 10 bucks or something but you clip it on and it goes right over your camera so it's just like a little a little flash thing voice chat interesting for example, you can open voice chat for the stream. Now, can I, for this stream, can I, like, with Discord, can I stream via YouTube? Or would it just have to be, like, a Discord-only thing where I have, like, a voice chat? There's another alternative to Discord called Guided, Gilded, that is free and similar to the paid version of Discord. Interesting. Gilded. I've never heard of that. Although I do use that term sometimes. Someone asks me how I'm doing. Like, I'm Gilded. God, okay, let me put this back. Because I, you know, you know how I am. I get like, sometimes I can be a scatterbrain. So this looks like it's all plugged in. So I'm going to unplug it. Should be good. Check my email really quick. Nothing, just a reminder to pay rent. It's never fun. Okay, so we have our keyboard. Let me open up my thing here. I'm looking right at you. Oh. Okay, so let me... Oops, I'll just open this new one, and it's very bright, so let's recalibrate, but now this is probably going to be very dark, isn't it? Let's recalibrate again, and you know what, I'll change this to a darker background, that might help. There you go, thinking on my feet. What up, John? I don't always know when you have time to stream, but announcing your stream before might lead to more viewers. Yeah, you know what? I think that I think that you're probably right. I think there's a part of me that's a little hesitant to have like more people, but I need to get over it. Because you're a hundred percent right. An earlier version of the keyboard. What what company was the keyboard when you bought it? Was it a yoktai, or was it the one that had that controversy? It could be the same company, I don't know. But I just remember there was a lot of controversy in the in the groups, in the in the Procreate community, and it wound up that like it wound up that for some reason the company just had to change name, but it it did, it wasn't like a scam or something like that. I didn't pay for this one. This one they sent me um, because they contacted me through my group, so. I didn't I didn't pay for this one. This is just to try out and to see if it's good and if it is cool then I'm happy to put it on the group. Okay, so it is the same. Okay, so let me see if I can remember what I'm supposed to do here. So let me turn Bluetooth off Bluetooth on on this. Okay, looks like Bluetooth is already on. Okay. So that's fine. So I turn this on. Okay, we have some lovely blinking going on, so that must be pairing. Oh, I think I hold this down, maybe? Let's see. Maybe I have to go into Bluetooth here. No, I didn't want to disconnect that. I wanted to do that. Apple Pencil connected. Bluetooth settings. Okay, we have a Yuktai. P 
pairing. Would you like to pair? I would like to pair. Thank you. Yeah, I mean, it, I mean, it, it is a double-edged sword. It's just sometimes I need to. Sometimes I need a kick in the butt. That's really all it is. Sometimes I need a little pinch, just a little, a little nip. But I should, and I have been thinking about it. And I did do it a couple times on Instagram, but Instagram isn't a great conduit. There's not a lot of crossover, I think, from Instagram. But Facebook groups, like my Facebook group, I definitely should. And I've been thinking I need to set up like a nice post like a day before and just say like, for example, tomorrow, like be like, oh, I'm going to be on at this time specifically. That's definitely what I need to do. Okay, back to Aoktai. So I should be connected. So I am connected. I am connected. So... Uh, let's just use a brush here and okay so let's this is supposed to make the brush bigger I think so here's some markings oh the brush is getting bigger the brush is getting bigger okay so let's see if I can draw and make it smaller at the same time ooh That's cool. Okay, I like that. I don't remember what everything is. So let's see what this does. Okay, so that's that. Great. I don't think I can... So that's still... I don't think I can go down. I don't think I can move. Oh, so this makes full screen. Oh, sorry. Why not post now? Charmaine. Facts. Facts. I don't, I don't even know how to respond. It's, it's, it's the truth. Um, all right, let's do it. Let's do it. Let me get rid of this. Actually, that one was nice. That's nice. Put that right in the middle. That's a nice design. Okay, so I'll do it really quick. So I need to go, I need to, go to YouTube here. Because I need the link. Oh, God. Go oh God. Pause this. Share copy link. Okay. I'll X out and I will go to Facebook. I'll go to my group. Oh, I think I just want to do regular. Oh, maybe I should do festive. What should I say? Come say hello on my live stream? What's a good... Uh, I'll do this in caps. So I'll do it in all caps. And now I have to do the link. Okay, that goes away, but that's fine. Come by the live stream. That's probably better. Come. Whoops. No, everything is caps. I can't think. I'm, I'm too nervous. <laughs> I'm not really. Right now, I'll put that in parentheses. Uh, okay, everything's there, everything's there. Okay, post it, it's in the ether. Should I do it on Instagram too? I have some great messages I have to re reply to. I like that. That's my guy. Um story 
create. Man, we're gonna get some weird people. <laughs> you gave him this shirt. <laughs> oh god. Oh, I can't put the I can't put the link here. I got to put the actual link. Um, what do I have to do? I have to do this. This I feel like an old person sometimes. I am an old person. Yeah, we probably could get some some interesting people on here. No, it's out there. It's in the ether. Omicron. Okay. <laughs> weird people are here already. Here come the weird Instagrammies. I don't think they come over. I don't think I don't think Instagram crosses over. Instagram is a strange thing. Like sometimes I'll look at my analytics for Instagram and like people on Instagram they just wanna they just wanna keep it scrolling. That's it. But that's okay. At least now it's in their hands. They have the option. Give a name to your followers. Like what's up, readers? Oh, I guess I do. Do I use my my real name on this? Um <laughs> I love that. More YouTubers have a name for the viewers, especially on the intro of their videos. Facts. I do like the, I watch the Pat Down, uh, or I listen to it. I listen to that podcast. She, she's so funny. That's just such a funny podcast. And uh, what are they, what are they called? The, uh, oh, what are, what is their, what are their fans called? I think they're called the Crack Babies. I think that's the name of their fans. But that's interesting. I mean, I never really thought about that. But uh, that's a good one. I don't know. I gotta think of. I gotta think of something good. Okay. Anyway, back to the keyboard. So, welcome. If there's any, oh, thirteen. Welcome to anyone who has come over. We are doing some really fun stuff. We're trying out a keyboard, and so far we've worked out that I can change the size, which I'm really excited about. And I can actually change the size as I'm working, which is cool. Very, very cool. So this takes away everything. I gotta make sure I'm on screen. I'm new, I'm new at this. So that takes away the frame. Wait, what does this do? Let me do let me let me let me paste something on the canvas. Insert a photo. I kinda wanna paste my little radish we'll paste this guy we'll paste my little my little robot guy just because I want to see what some of this stuff do so what does this do I actually don't know what that does oh it just pulls up the pulls up the canvas okay what does that do so let's see if I can undo, maybe. I'll make a new layer, go like this. So that's not undo, what's undo? So this is undo, right? Okay, so this is undo. There he is, folks. <laughs> there he is. My man, Matt Connolly, what's up, man? Always a pleasure to, to see, to, to see you in the streams. Okay, so undo, redo, undo, redo, very useful. Okay, so now I've drawn and I want to erase. So that's cool. You know what, I can probably, I can probably just, oh, I know what I can do. I can get rid of myself. I can get rid of myself, I think. Oh, maybe I can get rid of this one. Laptop. Oh no, but I don't have it stretched out. I don't have the screen stretched out. Let's see if I can stretch it out here. 
Yeah, this is a... My streams are the wild, wild west. They're the wild, wild west. Okay, so I'll put that here. I'll put this here right underneath. Look at that. MKBHD who? <laughs> totally kidding. Um, what's up, mister? Mamero, Mamwaro, Nizake, and Co. I think I probably got that right. After, I mean, I think it took me a while, but I think I got there. Of course, my pleasure. I like, you know, I like doing this fun stuff. So let me make this full, my little robot guy full. Okay, so we did that. Quick menu. Okay, so that's this. I never actually use the quick menu, but maybe I should. So quick menu. Flip vertically. What am I flipping vertically? Oh, interesting. Quick menu. Clear layer. Go back. The back button. Undo. That's key right there. That's really nice. That feels really cool so far. Let me undo that red. Okay, so this goes to the paint. So if I change colors and I go like this. Will this change back to red? I know that just goes to the brush. Oh, this is, I think this is switch. This switches back to the color. Nice. Look at those quick undos. Okay, what's this? Color picker. Okay, great. Color pick it again. It, it goes away. Selection tool. Selection tool. So if I want to select this. Oh, how do I how do I copy and paste? I think I go here. I think that was copy. Copy. Wait, did it copy the selection? Did it copy the layer? So if I go like this, copy, paste. It did. Did paste that part? That's good. So let me go back. What are you up to, MC? What are you doing today? How's the fam? Google, I'm not talking to you. You never work in that. You never work when I'm in Google Maps and I want you to send somebody a message. Then you never want to respond to me. But when I'm doing my live videos, that's when you want to like be all be all tender and listen listen to me speak. Multiple menus, quick menu, multiple menus. Quick menu. I don't like how it doesn't stay on the thing though. That's a bit weird, right? Like it actually goes off the. I wonder if it just is, depends on. Okay, so maybe it just depends on where that is. Okay, interesting. So I did selection tool. What is this again? Oh, that's the transform tool. Okay, that's the transform tool. Cool. Hue Satcher. Oh, it comes it comes it comes right up, folks. <laughs> That'd be cool, right? Um Yeah, I, I don't know why. I had so much fun with this little raccoon. And I still haven't seen what inspired me to make these cute raccoons in the first place, which is a Disney short called Far From the Tree. Um, I think I just saw like a trailer for it and I was like, I want to draw some raccoons. So then I started drawing these cute raccoons because that trailer looked super cute, but I've never seen it. But I did see in Canto, it goes where your pen is. Oh. So let me get rid of this. First, let's have some, ooh, ooh. Black and white, now let's. Goes where my pen is. I'm gonna try that out. I like mess. I like playing with colors though. It's always fun. So let me go back until this is gone. Okay. Goes where my pencil is. Oh, wrong button. Wrong button. So let me go back. I think. How do I get out of here? How do I clear? 
Oh, quick menu. Okay, so I think at least for this, it just, ooh, oh, oh. Yeah, interesting. Disney Plus, yeah, I gotta check it out. I definitely gotta check it out Far From The Tree. Um, and actually, I think the creator of it, um, she liked my, I did some sketches that I uploaded, and of course I did hashtag Far From The Tree. Uh, did I tag her? I might have tagged her. I can't remember if I tagged her. I might have tagged someone that did some of the sketches for it, and I think she saw it, like the creator. I think I, one of the, I think his name is Jam Woodser. I think that's his name on Instagram. But he does a lot of uh, illustrations and stuff for Disney. I love seeing his stuff. And he did some of the sketches of the raccoons, but she created it, so she like liked it. So this, it's always cool when people that like work on these amazing projects like actually acknowledge you even in some little way. It's really awesome. It's really fun. Uh, okay, so this is hue, saturation, color balance, whatever. So, it, oh, this is color balance, which I don't usually use too much. I wonder how I, an easy way to get out of it. Okay, so X. So I can use X to get out of stuff. And it also goes back with the color. Okay, so what were the other, what were the... I did, I did control copy, I did command X, I did command V, I did that. There was a couple other ones that I wanted to try. <laughs> Mr. Pink Nightcap, I love it. My cat is a girl. Sorry. <laughs> um. Oh, thank you. No, I appreciate that. Oh, we got a we got a bot in there. These bots always come by. All right, so what was I just wanted to try and do these last. Oops, that's the Chinese version. I just wanted to do these last ones. Remove the layer. So command. So this removes the layer. Clear layer. Was I on a new layer? I feel like it didn't clear the layer though. Let's see if it clears that. Hmm. So it says clear layer. Am I doing something wrong? Remove the layer. So maybe this first and then this? No. Clear layer. I thought it would it should I thought it would do that. Oh, but that's not even clearing. That's weird. Clear. Oh, maybe there's a... Some keys cannot be used. I bet input method can be used to changing... Please do the following. My on-screen keyboard. Let's see if that's an issue. If I wanted to add text. Okay. This is a little strange, but maybe I'm on a layer below. Edit text. Okay, that's a bit weird. So there is a bit w uh, there is some weirdness here going on. What if I just what if I minimize all of these layers? So there is a little bit of weirdness. Edit text. Unless maybe it's really small, but it doesn't look like it's small. There's no text there. Edit text. Now let me choose a different type. Size bigger. Hello. Okay, so yeah, for some reason the type isn't working. So it's just not there. Um, how to activate your on-screen keyboard. Please do the following iPad settings, settings, accessibility. Uh, 
how to activate your on-screen keyboard, please do the following in iPad settings. iPad settings. So not Procreate settings, iPad settings. Settings, accessibility, touch, assistive touch, assistive touch, show on-screen keyboard. Do I have to turn it on first? Show on-screen keyboard. Mouse keys, select mouse keys, select mouse keys, close mouse keys. So did I, do I, do I then, do I now close it? Select mouse keys, close. Um, I don't know, maybe I'm supposed to leave it on let me go out come back in okay the text is here now so let me edit it ooh uh oh uh oh so let me go back here to settings Oh, how do I get my windows again? I can't remember how to do that. I can never remember how to do that. Do I swipe up? Um, go to settings. Let me turn this back off. See if that does anything. Edit text. Okay, so that seems to worked, have worked fine. So let me make sure this is still working. Okay, so undo works. Let's see if I can clear the layer. Oh, the layer cleared this time. So I'll go forward. So I'm gonna duplicate, I'm gonna rasterize one. So can I clear this layer? Layer is cleared. Now can I, should I go forward or can I go back and get the layer back? I can, okay. All right, so that was weird. Hopefully the text thing works fine now. Add text. Show keyboard, I mean, I don't mind that. It seems to be working. Should be good. X. Oops. Oh, now it's typing X. Okay, let me get rid of these and bring back my guy, just so there's something more interesting than a blank screen. Okay, remove the layer, decrease, decrease brush size, oh, by 1%. Okay, that's easy. And then copy, cut, paste. Okay. Couple, couple um, grammatical errors, but I will let those slide because I cannot speak Chinese or write Chinese, so I, I, can't, I can't speak at all. So I would say, um, I would say this is pretty cool, actually. I would say it's very useful. I'm going to try to use it in my normal flow. Um, but even just like, I mean, I guess double tapping is easy too, but uh, the backspace is pretty cool. Hue saturation. It's kind of like, kind of close. So I don't have to go all the way over here. I can just use this hand. Um, so that's kind of nice. I, I feel like, I feel like it can be very useful once I once I just get used to using it, it doesn't really take up that much room, but it also just looks a little bit far out. It looks a little cool. Oh, I don't have my other my other camera. No, actually, it's good. I'll leave it. I'll leave it down. So what do we have? We have so we have ten. So I don't think we really had that many people come over from Facebook. Um, because we we still have ten, but that's cool. You know, I'm getting I'm breaking out of my shell little by little. Um. But let's see. Let's see if anyone commented on it. So I'm going to go with... Is this the little display capture? Or should I go full display? It's full display. I'll go full display. All right, so let's see. I think I can scratch my nose in safety. It should be full. Let me go. Let me just check OBS again. I have to keep checking 
because my brain can't remember what I did a second ago. So let's refresh this. And let me go, wait, did I, I hope I did it on in Procreate Tutorials and not on my regular. Did I just do it in my, on my Facebook page? Oh, I did. Such a dumb dumb. Um, so stupid. You know, you know what? I'm going to post this to my Facebook page anyway. Ugh, oh, come on. That's what happens when you deal with, when I'm dealing with myself. Okay, so what do I need to do? I need to go back to my Facebook group. Duh. So I'll see if anyone else will come on quickly. So let me, let me, what's my link again? Oh, it's so funny seeing the delay. Copy. It's funny, like I'm streaming and I feel like my fiance is also doing like video calls. All right, so now I, th I, I, th I think it's posted to Procreate Tutorials. I'm going to delete it from my main page because I don't want, there's not really, I don't think anyone's going to really care on my main page. So I'll just go ahead and, but two people liked it, so that's cool. At least I think they did. Oh, I almost deleted it from my regular page. Oh, did I already? No, this is old. All right, so this is my Facebook page. Where is the other thing? I don't see it anymore. So appropriate tutorials. Oh, I posted it twice. Okay, so I can delete it. I posted it in the right spot. So two people liked it. That's cool. All right, let me go back to my peoples over here. Okay, OBS, OBS, Elgato. I did, I did post it in the right spot. I don't know why it looked like, it looked like I didn't, but I th I'm pretty sure I did. I'm pretty sure I did. Oh, oh, heavens. Um, but yeah, I think that's, what else did I want to do? What else did I want to do tonight? I don't even know. I do want to do some drawing, but I might wait, I might wait for a little bit. Only because like, I feel like it's, I feel like if I do start drawing, I should do it on a different stream. Like I feel like I should start like a drawing stream and like change the change the the title and stuff. I just wanted to focus on this keyboard. Um, oh, I know what I can do. I can actually edit this video. I can edit this video down to just doing the Aoitai stuff. That's probably what I need to do. Oh, three-year-old baby. <laughs> I appreciate you stopping by. It's been a pleasure. And go take care of that little baby. Um, but yeah. Unless there's any other questions. Or you want me to do anything else. I think I can I can probably chill. Maybe go like take a shower. Relax for a little bit. Oh, I actually, oh, I, I actually did a, uh, I did an intro too. Let's see what that looks like. Let's see what my intro looks like. So let me go to... MacBook Pro, and then we'll go here. Oh, and that's not here. Clip. Oh, these are old videos. These are videos that, that I took the other day of my phones. Oh, let me make sure the the sound is working. The sound is working. Okay, just wanted to make sure. So these are yeah, these are my these are my phones. This is. Oops. 
This is the iPhone. That's what I was filming on. That's the new iPhone. It's my old Pixel. It's my new Pixel. And this is my real old Galaxy S7 Edge. But I will say they all have a use. The iPhone, the old iPhone doesn't really have a use anymore. But I do still use these quite often. Um, obviously, this one is my production phone that I'm filming on right now. This is my main phone that I take everywhere and use with like data and stuff. This one is like my media phone. So like I use this in my car to listen to music. I download like stuff on this phone, watch movies and stuff on this phone. It's like my work workhorse phone for like watching movies and TV and stuff. And this one I kind of just like leave around. So when I need to like Google or check stuff, I just, I don't know. I just always try to take care of my phones uh, for the, and have them for a long time for as long as possible. Where's the sound? Oh, I muted. They sent me this for free. I did not pay for it. It is a Procreate keyboard, and I'm going to see if it's any good. I'm going to set it up and see if it's easy to set up, if it's useful for me, if it's useful, and just see what I think about it. Because um, Anyway, so that's the little, that's my, that's why this is here. Let me switch back to my regular OBS. Anyway, so that's the little, that's my, that's why this is here. Oh, God, i got to mute this. What's playing? Why, why is it playing? Anyway, so yeah, that's why this is here. Because this is the this is when I do those sh those shots. I turn on this light, and I turn around. I turn around and face this like that, and I use this camera. Why'd you get scared, baby? Why'd you get scared? What are you scared of, huh? Why'd you get scared? Come on. Why'd you get scared? I heard you jump. You must have had a bad dream. Did you have a bad dream? Huh? I think I think the cat had a bad dream. Did you have a bad dream? Let me put the camera on you. Display capture. Did you have a bad dream? Huh? I heard you jump. <laughs> Why is your head down? Why is your head down? Did you have a bad dream? You did. I think you did. I think you had a bad dream, baby. Right? I think you had a bad dream. It's okay. Yeah, this is like the this is like the spot now. Right on my lap. Right? You have bad dreams, baby. You're okay. I wonder if you can hear that. Ooh. Don't kiss the microphone, baby. Her name is Athena, and she is definitely like a rascal. Um, usually when she's in here, she's pretty good. Like, especially when she's like sits on the chair that's behind me. Oh, I don't know why this is on. Actually, it looks kind of cool. Um, I, oh, I did order another lamp too, but it's going way in the back. And it like changes color and stuff, but it's also like a, a round lamp. I'm, I can't wait for that to come. Um, but yeah, she's, she's like a, she's definitely a rascal. Um, she's usually good when she's here. When she's on my lap, she's usually good. She sits in the chair. She's good, but she can be like a handful. Um, but I just use the squirt gun because I don't really like. I'm not like technically like a cat person. Like I like, yeah, Athena. Um, I like cats, and I, the outdoor ones are really, really they're really sweet cats. But I have like an inherent fear of cats. Um, not to where like I have I don't have like a phobia of cats or anything. Like I like cats. Like if I see a cat out in the street, like I'll kneel down and like if I have some kibble on hand I'll try to like give it some food but I'm inherently scared like because I, I don't I can't really read cats cats are like more difficult to read and they're more they're such fat they're so fast twitch them um, I always think like oh I can't tell if this cat like wants um 
some wants to be padded or if it want if it's gonna like swipe my hand with its razors on its claws. I just never know with cats, so like I always have that inherent fear um, of cats. So I just use a squirt gun um, whenever I need whenever I need her to do anything or go anywhere. Like when I feed the out, outdoor cats, I have to like kick her out of this room because she'll go crazy and like she'll she can't be with other cats. I can't open the door because she'll run out of the house and then it'll be like a nightmare. So, um, but yeah, I think I might do some drawing or relaxing or uh, they are unpredictable. Um, yeah, I think I'll just I think I just go do some chill, some chilling. Um, which will probably mean editing this video, to be honest with you. I'll probably download it and then edit it, so, um, Cat will tell you how it feels. It kind of, it kind of will, but I feel like cats will all you also not tell you how they feel. They'll just look at you, and then the, and then, and they'll look adorable, and they'll look at you, and then you'll go to pet them, and like, they'll just, before you know it, like, they've swiped. 100 pound greyhound oh damn wow um but if a cat like if a cat does t tell me how it feels i i appreciate it um but yeah athena's been athena's pretty good she's as she as she gets older she's a little bit more relaxed she can still be a rascal especially with my fiance like she's you know like she's, it's like her baby so the cat can be like biting her and she's like, oh, like, you know, what are you doing? Whatever. I'm like, no, I'm like, I discipline, like I squirt her right in the face. Yeah. Sometimes I see her tail freaking out and I always warn her. I'm like, look, I, I'm, I say, oh, I don't have my squirter right here. I'm like, I will cool you down if your tail is going. I'm allergic to cats, too, but I get I can get used to them. I don't know if it works like I guess maybe it doesn't probably doesn't work like that for everyone, but if I'm around a cat long enough, then I'm fine. Oh, a dachshund. I I did a I did my um one of the images uh so I did I did um uh Oliver Gilmore a do, uh not a dachshund's diary. I was It's okay. <laughs> I didn't mean to squeeze you. It's okay, baby. I didn't mean to squeeze you. I did this. Let's see. A Doxy's a Doxy's diary. That's what I that's what I was forgetting. Um but I also he also, um Greg Magoon, he also did another project. Um and I worked on uh let me bring this up real quick. So this and this, I think. And this. Hello, Reddish. So let me find my... I took a photo of the, the book cover. My mom ordered a bunch of them. But they look really good. So I did this. Um, oh, oh. Once Upon a Fairy Tale. So it only goes big and small. Oh, there we go. Oh, there we go. But I did this whole project. Oh, I, I think I I think I need to do a behind the page on this drawing too, because this was like this was a heavy this was a heavy drawing like it was a lot. Oh man, don't tell me I got dust. I'm gonna have to get that off on Photoshop. I have to get that off of this picture. Because I love the picture, but I need to get that little dust speck off. Let me go back to Elgato. No, I got to get rid of display capture. Okay. Oh, you know what? I need to just... I have to remember that I can just go here and go back. I'm still trying to... I'm still becoming effective at this OBS thing. I can't wait for Dream, Dream Machine 2. That's like... Uh, I'm, uh, he self publishes. He did it. He, he added a couple things to the drawings because obviously when we were working, we had to make sure that they weren't exact replicas of the Disney princesses. So we did have to alter some things. I altered some things, some colors, some specific clothing designs, things like that. 
Um, but I think he's self-published. Um, but I'm not certain. Let's see. Let's look. So let me go back here. Um, let me just get out of here. Oh, someone commented, but I don't know if they commented my live. Yeah, so someone commented that, you know, we don't really need a keyboard. And I was of the same mind, so that's why I wanted to check it out. two comments so I think one is just me okay so what was I gonna do oh that's right so let me look up um, just look up Greg okay so I don't want to I don't want to do the sound I'm not sure about the sound if he I don't want it to affect my video so I'm not gonna do the sound but um yeah, this is like a little, his little preview of it and stuff like that. And I wonder if he has... So he has his little preview thing there. And how do I... How do I go back? So how do I go to the regular page? How do I get to... So I'll go to books. Home maybe? So I can't really see if I wanted to if I wanted to buy it. I thought it would be easy to just come here and figure out a way to a way to buy it, but There we go. I clicked on it really quick. Once upon a fairy tale an advent an Oliver Gilmore adventure paperback. So it's on Amazon. That's great. Very nice. Very cool. So I'm gonna put this link in the uh, in the show notes. I'm gonna call them show notes. I did it. What's the matter, baby? What's the matter? So I'll put this in the show notes. Let me edit video. I think it's really cool that I can edit the video like on the fly. I like that. Don't look at me. Oh, your breath. Okay, so I edited that, and now I'm just going to save that. Okay. Cool. So let me go back here, and... Cat Rock is terrible. Cat Breath is terrible. Uh, oh, no, we'll do... We'll do... We'll do this one. Although, although it's super bright. And my... I'm setting, like... And it's so hard to be in the middle. Oh, you got the appropriate thing. Ron Deese, what's up? Dream Machine Illustration. Thank you so much. I can show you... Oh, did I show? I might have already showed another sneak preview of a... John, thank you. I did try it, so it's the beginning of this video. This video is going to end soon. Um, I find it really hard to end 
live streams because it's just fun. Uh, it's actually, I think it's going to be very useful. Um, I didn't have to pay for this one, so I just kind of like checked it out. I wanted to see if it was even useful, if it was like convenient. It seems like it, it seems like it could be very convenient, especially when you get used to it. Um, because I have started using my other hand for certain things, but it's kind of just nice to just have it here. So I feel like uh, if you didn't know on YouTube, you can post your live stream before you stream. True. Um, I haven't really looked. I haven't really looked into that only because I've been doing the thing where I stream on Twitch and and YouTube. But I think I can probably. I think what you're saying is I can probably still set the date and time and then just still stream the way I normally do. I think I can probably do it that way. Um, oh, thanks, Restream. I got a, a hundred messages. That's cool. Um, but I, I, I mean, I, I do like it. I do think that it's cool. I think that it'll be useful because there's just a few things like that I, that I use all the time. So even if I use like three things, like even if it's the back and the undo or if it's the, um, like the brush size up and down, like I think that's really good. And I also like that I can do command and go up and down by 1%. I think that's really good. The keyboard is on sale on their website. Um, so I guess I should put, oh, this is bad. You, you guys are looking at like half my face. And this is really, really dark. This one is always dark. And I guess I can, I'll just go with the regular. So let me go to their website, actually. That's probably the smart thing to do. Uh, so let me... Actually, let me keep both of those. Oh, I was trying to get free music. Free music for some YouTube videos. So, A-O-I-K... Did I get that right? T-Y-E... Okay, you're in promotion. Chat with them. You guys are cool. Thirty-five ninety-nine. Okay, pretty simple. Nice, nice. Let's see what else they have. Oh, so they have one of these these funny gloves that I never really was into. I never I never really used them. So they have a a holder. Oh, they got. They do have Apple Pencil first, second, first and second. Maybe they have. Cause I know first and second are probably different, right? One piece, two H. Super pencil tips. Oh, they go over the tips. I don't know. I gotta figure out a way that I can see my. Let me make this smaller, so I can see my chat. There we go, that's better. Um, I want to see how this looks on OBS. But I can't. Um, Seashell, what's up? <laughs> they should they should sponsor me. Like they definitely got they definitely are getting some easy um, sponsorship. Uh, what camera do I use to record your iPad? I am using the iPhone 13 Pro that I bought like two weeks ago. Maybe two weeks ago? I did an unboxing of it, um, I think that day. But uh, yeah, I'm using the iPad, iPad, or I'm using the iPhone 13 Pro to record on, and it's great. It's really good, coming from an iPhone 6S. So definitely... Uh, definitely a step up. I think I saw some of these on Amazon, on Amazon because I need something like this because this Apple Pencil is so small. Wait, let me let me just the Apple Pencil is so small, so like I find myself like I'm pressing so hard here that my finger gets sore. And I'm not pressing down on the screen, but I just press so hard like this. But I, I really feel like I just need this to be fatter. 
Like I need a fatter thing. And I was thinking about getting a whole cover, but I don't know if it's better. Like this is just from a, this is from a mechanical pencil that I just took off and put here and it helps. But I think I want something thicker. I think I want a fatter Apple pencil. Oh, I should also say, wait, wait, let me get this. I wonder if I can like, I don't know, but I'm also, oh, let me try to focus this. There we go. I'm also using Filmic Pro. So I'm using an iPhone 13 Pro. And then on my iPhone 13 Pro, I'm using an app called Filmic Pro. And this app, Filmic Pro, allows you to export. God, I'm over here looking at my hands. So this Filmic Pro allows you to export clean HDMI from the phone. So once you play it, like whatever's on the phone screen, will export full HDMI uh, out. So I have a lightning to HDMI adapter coming out of the iPhone. I have the power cord going into the adapter and I have HDMI going into the adapter. I have HDMI, I have HDMI going into the computer through an Elgato Cam Link 4K. That's like a hundred bucks. And the Elgato Cam Link 4K is plugged into a dongle because the Elgato is regular USB. So I have it plugged into a USB 3 um, slot on my dongle. I hate that word. Dongle is such a doofus kind of word. Dongle. You have one that's fatter at the ends. Interesting. I keep, my f I keep fingering my Apple Pencil off my desk when I draw. Oh, flinging. Not fingering. <laughs> this one is so small. Like, actually, I, I think I prefer... I, I think I prefer the rounder one. Maybe because maybe it's just because it's heavier. Maybe the grip is a little bit better. I think the grip is probably a little bit thicker. But I think I, I prefer this for, for some reason. But I think I just need a thicker one. But I still use this. I still use this all the time. Um... Look at this. This animal is still here. What's a what's a good oh I guess I can use this camera. Probably can't see my lap at all. You probably still can't see my lap. But, yeah, I don't know which one I'm going to get, though. So that's why I wanted to look, uh, let me just do it on here. Let me do this one that I can make smaller. Because then at least I can make it small, but not too small. Um, oh, but that's weird. But then my... Is it still going to be turtles all the way down? If I do this? I'm really curious what it, what it looks like. But I, I don't think I can see. I'll have to look back on the video. I don't know. Have any of you ever used these Apple Pencil tip covers? Like, are you supposed to draw with the tip covers on them? That seems so weird. Like, it just seems like it would negate the sensitivity of the... Apple Pencil tip. I feel like I don't want it as a square, though. Like, I feel like that's a weird, a kind of a weird shape. Oh, I guess it doesn't look that bad. I might have to, I mean, I, I might have to try them out. Maybe I'll reach out to them. Maybe I'll reach out to them and I will do, um, cause honestly, like I will be happy to, uh, 
to try these out on live and like make videos if they're good. I'm very, very happy to. Um, magnetic cap. But that would be useful because that's something that I need. I use silicone tip from the Netherlands. It doesn't seem to affect function. Interesting. So you use a tip on the Apple Pencil um, and you have the Apple Pencil, at, you know, the two. So you use the tip and it doesn't seem to, you don't have any issues with it. And I'm assuming it's, it probably, I, I guess you, then you don't have to really worry about the tip wearing out. Even if it was to wear out, eventually you could just, you still have your protected regular tip. I mean, that seems like a great, it seems like a great deal. Green pen cover. Yeah, see, like, I feel like I want something like this. Like, it looks kind of chunky, but I feel like I need something fat. Like, not that my hands are really big, but, like, with this Apple Pencil, my, my hands feel really big. Like, this feels like a small pencil for some reason to me. I'm probably just getting getting fatter as I get older. Good to know. So, I'll yeah, I'll probably reach out to them and see if they want to send me. Because, I mean, I'm sure there's a lot of people that just haven't used them and never used them. And I'm happy to do, like, I'm happy to make a video and just kind of show them and see if uh, if they're worth it. Why not? Um, but so far, they've been great. They sent it really quickly. And the, the keyboard seems cool. So uh, I'll, I'll see what they say. And if not, you know, no big deal. But might as well use my little baby following uh, for, you know, what I can and, you know, help people out if if people if people want to see what it's all about, I'm cool with that. Welcome to the fold, Aoiktai. Really want to know how you're supposed to say that in actuality. All right, let me. I gotta go to the bathroom, so let me get on out of here. But lovelies, I gotta set up a. This is full face. This is the Nozomi. I also have to set up a. Um, I have to set up one that's just the images. That's just my, my cameras. Maybe this one can be that one. Do I have a laptop? Laptop cam. What is this supposed to be? Let me delete this. I don't know what this capture device is, but I need to add a media source. No. Video capture device. Add existing. Nozomi there yeah so that's fine all right you guys it's been fun it's been great not you there you go see you later oh it's been great i think this is a great video so far this thing is pretty cool so far so i'm happy that it's working out i'm going to talk to the company see if i can get some more stuff that i can try out help everyone linda granger always a pleasure Always a pleasure. My, you're like my um, my angel on my shoulder. You're like my conscience. Uh, John G, pleasure. Thank you for coming by. Um, and everyone else, I'm not going to go through because there's a bunch. Jin, Charmaine, appreciate you guys. Seashell, um, MC, uh, Eternal Shadows. Um, yeah, I appreciate all you guys. It's re been really fun. I love doing lives. So I will catch you guys. Uh, and then let me start over. Keep drawing. And I will see you guys in the next video. Charmaine! <laughs> Alright, let's see. I always, I'm always slow to stop this stream. And you catch me mumbling it.